Welcome to another calculation video on redox titrations. So have a read of the question and once you're ready, press play so we can go through the answer. So the first thing that we're going to do is identify the reducing agent and the oxidizing agents in this question. We have two identical beakers, both containing iron two plus and three plus ions. Again, the concentration and molar ratio of iron two plus and three plus is the same in both beakers. We want to work out the concentration of iron two plus and three plus. So in the first beaker, we react manganate. We use 15 centimeters cubed of 0.02 moles per dm cubed. Now remember, manganate is an oxidizing agent and in the beaker we have iron two plus and three plus. It will only react with the two plus because that is the reducing agent. In the second beaker, we first add zinc and zinc converts all of the three plus back into two plus. And as expected, we end up using more manganate this time. Of course, the reason behind that is because we've now got extra two plus, which has all come from the three plus. The goal of the question is to work out the concentration of iron two and three plus in the solution. So starting on the left, let's work out the moles of manganate. We're going to use the formula number of moles is equal to concentration times volume over a thousand. That will give us three times 10 to the power of minus four moles. So then we'll use our redox half equations to work out the ratio of manganate to iron two plus. Once you have the moles of manganate, we're going to times that by five and we should get the moles of iron two plus in the solution. Okay, so now that we know the moles of iron two plus, let's work out the moles of iron three plus. Remember, zinc converts three plus into two plus so that we can react it with manganate. Again, we're going to work out the moles of manganate used. Once we have the moles of manganate, we are then going to times it by five again, and we should get the moles of iron two plus. Now you might be thinking, where did this extra two plus come from? On the left, we had 1.5 times 10 to the power of minus three. How come we have 1.9 times 10 to the minus four on the right? So don't be worried about that. Remember the extra two plus is simply from the three plus ions that have converted into two plus. So we already had two plus, but now we have more because we've converted some three plus into two plus. So we can simply subtract the difference and that will give us the moles of iron three plus. Okay, so now that we know the moles of iron two plus and three plus in the solution, let's work out their concentration. So to work out concentration, we're going to use the formula number of moles equals concentration times volume over a thousand. We're then going to simply rearrange it and work out concentration. So if I apply that to both of these ions, and I should get the final answer of 0.06 for iron two plus and 0.016 for iron three plus. Hey guys, if that video helped you, support our channel by liking, subscribing, and sharing it with your friends. And more importantly, if you still have questions, drop a post on our forum at examqa.com, where I will personally be there to help answer your questions. Mohammed signing out.